Alright guys, welcome back, and today we got a new Star Wars trailer that just dropped out of nowhere for a series called Tales of the Empire. Kind of like a sequel series to Tales of the Jedi. This is great. I'm so excited that they're doing this because Tales of the Jedi is so, was so good. And like with the Bad Batch coming to an end, like we need some more animated content. Like everyone's been saying like, oh we need like Tales of Jedi Season 2 or like Tales of the Sith. But for now we got Tales of the Empire, so let's check it out. Is that Thrawn? Years ago, my people were all but destroyed. Oh, that's uh. My anger gives me strength. It is that strength. From Ahsoka, I can't remember her name. Offer the Empire. Offer accepted. That's like a young Thrawn. May the Fourth, of course. I'm here to present you with an opportunity, Paris. Paris Hoffy! Just be glad you're not a Jedi. Yo! Your path is set, Morgan Elsbeth. Morgan Elsbeth, that's her name. I will fulfill my destiny. Cool! The Inquisitor! Mercy. Grand Inquisitor. Defeat. Damn! I'll help you overcome this weakness. Oh, cool! Oh, man! I would help to change things. Everything comes at a cost. Yo! Let's go, Grievous! Since I was a child. Oh! You cannot stop what has begun. Yo! Face one final test to join us. Damn! It is time you meet your new master. Oh shit! Oh, that was the Inquisitor from the Ahsoka episode. Long live the Empire! Let's go! That's cool! Yes! Oh, that looks so good. This is why we need more shows like this, because, like, we get to see those stories that, like, we wouldn't get to see otherwise. Like, we had Tales of the Jedi, which focused on Dooku and Ahsoka, and now we're getting Tales of the Empire, which focuses on Morgan Elsbeth and Barriss Offee. That's really cool. Like, we're gonna get to see, like, a younger Thrawn, like, meet Morgan Elsbeth on Dathomir, because she is a night sister. Like, that's so cool. Just, just the idea of seeing a young Thrawn is really cool, too. And then we saw Grievous there on Dathomir. Like, that was so awesome, man. I, I love Grievous. Grievous is one of the most underrated Star Wars characters, in my opinion. I love him so much. So, like, are we gonna actually get to see, like, the massacre on Dathomir, like, damn. Like, I'm sh like that's what the Grievous sequence is gonna be. Like, Grievous and all the battle droids just gonna wipe out all the Night Sisters. Damn. Although, I'm definitely way more excited for the Barriss Offee episodes because that arc in the Clone Wars is one of the most important arcs in the Clone Wars and one of the best, where Ahsoka is accused of bombing the temple, but it was really Barriss who bombed the temple and, like, was trying to frame Ahsoka which led to Ahsoka flat out just leaving the order entirely. Like that was such a good arc, and I can't wait to see like the expansion on that to get to see more of Barris and her become an Inquisitor. That's really cool. We're getting we're getting the Grand Inquisitors coming back, and of course we got a little little sneak peek of Vader in there. Just be glad you're not a Jedi anymore. That was D. Bradley Baker. You got blood. This looks like that same planet from the Mandalorian where she fought Ahsoka 
with, with the Beskar spear, which we can see she has right there. And two other really cool details. In that scene where Barris is standing next to all the other Inquisitors, we, we can see like the Inquisitor with like the bird mask from the uh, second Ahsoka episode. This I love that design. This, it's so creepy and cool. It's like a plague doctor. And then next to him, we can see Merrick from Ahsoka, which he was revealed to just be like Night Sister Magic. So is this like, so like, because like when he died in Ahsoka, we saw like the mist and every, like the green magic like just come out of him. So it's like, is he alive right here? And like he later like dies and then gets resurrected by the Night Sisters. Is that what is that what we saw in Ahsoka? It was just like his reanimated corpse, where like. Here we we see like his actual like living body, and I I don't know if like these two stories will cross paths like directly, but like maybe we see him die and like Morgan can resurrect him. Like that'd be kind of interesting and provide a little more context for Ahsoka. So yeah, this looks awesome, and I'm just so excited that they're doing more of these because like I said, the Bad Batch only has like a few episodes left, so. We need some more animation because animation is some of the best Star Wars and I'm just so glad they're doing more of these series because Tales of the Jedi was so good and this looks great as well. So that's going to do it for my reaction to the trailer for Tales of the Empire. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.